today I wanted to show you guys a real simple and free trick to disable AFM, active fuel management, while driving around town. Now you'll have to stay uh, below 75 I believe. So here's what you're going to want to do when you go into drive. You're going to want to go keep going down to the L. Now the L is either low or lock and some models have an M for manual mode. So what you're going to want to do is you want to come over here. You have a this shifter button right here. It's the plus or minus. You want to come all the way up. Tape put it all the way into five. Now what this does is only lets the truck come up to gear five. So it won't go in to gear six. Now what we'll do is we'll find the screen. See, this is the screen where it shows little V8. Now you want to keep your eyes posted on that while we're driving out. We'll go for a little city drive here and see how it does. All right, so when your truck goes into AFM uh, V4 mode, what it's doing is it's shutting down four of the cylinders on either bank, uh, two on each bank. So basically the ECM has a couple parameters that it wants to see before it enters into V4. Um, one of them being gear six on the six speed. So when you put your truck into drive, you wanna come all the way down to low or lock. Um, some older models is an M for manual. So what you're gonna to wanna to do is you're gonna to wanna to put it all the way up into L5. Now, if you put it into six, it's it'll, it'll allow the transmission to shift all the way up to six and eventually go into V4 mode when you come to a cruise. So you wanna keep it down in five. So just like that, L5. Now, this only works when you stay below about 70, 75. So it's perfect for around town on the freeway. The speed limit is only 65. Um, when you're going faster than that, it, it could kick the it, transmission up into sixth gear. So like I said, you're, you wanna keep it in L5 while you're driving. So here we go. All right, guys, here we are. I'm in lot L5, and we're cruising. Just keep your eyes on that V8 symbol. It shouldn't drop into V4 mode as long as you are in L5. See here, I'm going 40. Let off the gas. Oil pressure comes down, and no V4 mode. Pretty badass. Now, obviously, this is just a short-term uh, way to turn AFM off. It's not gonna. It's gonna be kind of annoying every time you get in your truck. You're gonna have to put it in L5, um, but it is a short-term and free way of turning AFM, AFM off. This is listed in the owner's manual as um, in-town towing. Um, it helps with in-town towing because obviously you're not going in between V4 and V8 while you're towing a heavy load. Sometimes it can be really annoying and this is GM's fix for turning off AFM while you're towing. As you can see, I was just at a stop. It, sh it shifts automatically all the way up into fifth gear. Um, it won't drop into sixth gear while you're cruising. Now, this could hurt your fuel economy a little bit but around town it's not going to be noticeable my suggestion would be to either buy the range disabler that you can get off amazon or several different websites um, or my opinion the best way is to buy a tuner um, my personal favorite is the set bdx uh, you can do flat it has several flash tunes out of the box and you can do cloud tunes now there's several websites five star tuning does custom tunes you can send them their your data logs and then they can send you a custom tune and you upload it with your bdx it's pretty cool i'm probably going to be doing a video soon on the set bdx so stay tuned and if you guys like this content please give a like subscribe it really helps out 
uh, just starting out and I'm hoping to do 